Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to another interesting and quick video today. Um, I'm going to use Google Colab, right? It's another place where you could write some Python code, execute your Python code. I'll put this link. You can go to collab.research.google.com and create a new notebook, okay? Notebook is similar to our Jupyter notebook we have done before. So you can create a new notebook and follow the code along that I've already made. Uh, this video is about downloading the transcripts or subtitles from a YouTube video, okay? So first of all, you need to install uh, some packages. I have already installed them, but if not, you need to use pip install. First one you need to install is pip install YouTube transcript API. And then also you need to install another package called as PyTube, okay? These are the first two steps, pretty straightforward. And then you need to follow along this code, okay? First, copy a video URL. This is one of my YouTube videos. So I put the URL and then I'm importing some packages like these two packages as you see. Then you need to create a YouTube object, right? So you say YouTube of video URL. Video URL is nothing but your actual URL, okay? And let's say you want to get the highest resolution. So you can say this command to get the highest possible resolution. Once you get that, the next step as you see is to go and actually download the video, right? And once you download the video, you want to extract the video ID, right? Video ID is nothing but this last part, right? After the is equal to whatever you have, that is what is the video ID. So by using the split function, we are trying to extract the video ID, right? Once that is done, once you have extracted the video ID, then you use this YouTube transcript API.get transcript function to get the transcript or subtitles of that particular video. You will get them one by one, right? So what we do then is, we are just like trying to join all these transcripts one by one together, right? By using a simple for statement. And then we try to print it onto screen, right? Suppose there is some problem, this uh, video does not have transcripts. It will print uh, transcripts are not available for this video. And in any other case, any other exceptions, you'll have to also uh, print that particular error that happened. So I'm just creating an accept statement, right? To give exceptions. So this is one specific, uh, you know, YouTube video. Uh, it's something I had put a few weeks back, I guess. So I'm just going to put that in here. Uh, and Imagine uh, this on your Basically, yeah, like four ways to showcase your data projects. Um, so if I now just execute this full code, it will take a few seconds. Now it's completed, right? And then on the bottom, I can see the transcript of that video. So it says, hello guys, welcome back to channel. Today, I'm going to give you four interesting ways you could showcase your data projects. Some of them are unconventional, but this could help you get your first job and so on, right? The complete transcript of the video is here, as you see. And in the end, I say like, I hope you enjoy this video. I'll see you again in another video. Till then, bye, right? So this is exactly what I have said. So I was able to extract, right? So now you can literally replace this video URL with you know any other video and easily download the transcript like this okay i'll put the link to this code also so you can use it and try it for yourselves i hope you enjoy this quick video on python i will see you again in another video till then take care